Now 632 happening today. The trans community and beyond will be watching the Ohio State House closely. Two pieces of legislation related to LGBTQ plus issues in Ohio are taking center stage at the State House. 10 TV's Kevin Landers is hearing from one of the proponents. Kevin. Well, good morning. Advocates of LGBT rights have raised concerns about this legislation. And today, both pieces will be discussed essentially at the same time here at the State House. Here is what we know. First is House Bill 6. It would ban transgender athletes in Ohio's elementary schools, high schools from participating in girls' sports. The bill is similar to the one that failed twice in the last General Assembly. The second is a House, Ohio House Bill 68. It's the Enact Ohio Saving Adolescents from Experimentation, also known as the SAFE Act. It would ban gender-affirming care for minors in this state. Yesterday, we spoke with Representative Gary Click, who introduced the bill. The SAFE Act is critical in Ohio because young people are being harmed and they're being damaged by this so-called gender-affirming care. It's really gender conversion care. They're, they're trying to convert a child's sex and gender, and kids are being harmed by this. What they're doing is they're setting a child's endocrine system at war against their DNA. Now, many in the medical community disagree. For instance, researchers at Columbia University recently published a study that found, quote, growing legislative attempts to limit, ban, or criminalize access to this critical model of medical care endangers the health and well-being of transgender and non-binary youth. And we'll be following this story throughout the morning and bringing the latest when we know it. Reporting live outside the Statehouse, Kevin Landers, 10TV News.